Hi, it's Miranda. There was a lot of discussion about Bratz dolls recently because there's a filter on TikTok that makes you look like one. It's pretty ridiculous. I never had a Bratz doll, but I did have the Mattel equivalent, My Scene Barbie. Does anyone remember those? So I happen to have a few of these dolls. Here's one of them. Her hair was in these rubber bands that kind of melted into her hair, so I kind of had to clip it up. Look at these. Do you see this? She's got regular Barbie feet. They're, these are just like little sleeves, basically. Just, see? A little choker. Um, and then I have... I think this was off of an old Skipper doll. Does anyone remember Skipper? So this is probably like 80s or 90s, and this is 2000s or something like that. And there you go, look at these. Maybe we should see the verses. If anyone's actually interested in seeing what the doll, the fashion was emulating, like, you know what I mean, like, at the time. But yeah, here you go, look at this little situation. This is a Mycene Barbie guy. I forgot their names. If anyone's just like, what were their names? I forgot. I, I, I would have to look it up. Maybe I'll look it up for editing purposes. I'll look it up and I'll, I'll put it up. If I can find it, because, you know, some stuff is just hard to find. Look at his shoes. You want to see his shoes? Fashion. He's got a watch and a bracelet. Fashion. It's fashion. Look at that. Low riders. Little tank. This is a, a little scarfy scarf. Let's take that off. Oops. This is a, an actual scarf that came with the dolls. I remember. I don't remember which dolls, but it was one of the. It was probably her, but it's clearly a fashion scarf. Look at this. Look at this thing. Look at this thing. It's not keeping anybody warm, Barbie. Okay, the last one. She's not wearing the Mycene shoes. She's got regular shoes on, so it's a little jarring that she's got normal size feet. Well, normal Barbie normal size feet. The rubber band is melted, but it's it's holding on right now. That rubber band is really it wants it's I can see where it's broken, so. Curly hair. She's the only one that's got curly hair of these. These shoes. Look at those. That's it. This was a short, silly video about some dolls. And it's all because of a filter. But you know what? I just want to have a quick discussion about it. Because I'm lucky enough that playing with dolls like this barely affected my view of my own body. I just have a view of my own body and like I don't feel like I was affected that that dramatically. That being said, I'm not gonna try and turn around and say just because I wasn't really affected, other people were not. That's the difference, that's the thing that I feel like more people can understand and learn if you haven't learned already because sometimes you can be very blind to other people's struggles and then you hear somebody talk and that's when I'm like, that's when then maybe you stop trying to make the counter arguments that you thought were correct because you're like, wait, I didn't have their experience, so I can say what I just said. You know? I can say, ooh, these dolls are so fun and cute, but some people were like, no, these actually damaged me and I have a problem for the rest of my life. So I'm a little privileged that I can say these were fun and I had fun playing with them. I used to do silly soap operas with my dolls uh, and, um, and a VHS camcorder, so recording things is not new for me. and. You never know. If you suddenly see a Barbie soap opera on my channel, I know I'm 43 years old. I know. Trust me. But the world is a little bit... If I feel like doing a Barbie soap opera, I'm gonna do one. That's all I'm saying. <laughs>